You know, I, I, I believe it's confirmed, but there's a part of me that still doubts just a little bit. I, I think it's No, true, I mean, it's, it's absolutely been no. confirmed. It was confirmed by Entertainment Weekly. Um, Gary Ross and Steven Soderbergh are close friends, and they sort of have a history of supporting each other's projects. So, yeah, he'll be doing, I think the article that I read said two days of filming. Um, I'm not he, really sure what he, what did, he can accomplish in two days. Yeah, that's what she I read too. That it was 11. two days. She could be just accomplished in two days. <laughs> well, that's um, what I actually. What, what I was just going to say is, um, yeah, I don't know a whole lot about Steven Soderbergh. Um, I've seen Traffic. I've seen parts of Che. Today I started to watch The Good German, but I didn't finish it. But I actually had a little email conversation with Lee about Steven Soderbergh, and she actually knows a lot about him, so she'd probably be the best person to talk to about what he's bringing to the table and and maybe why Gary Ross chose him. I guess that's kind of my cue to, to say something now. Yes, yes. On the spot. Okay, so let's talk about Mr. Soderbergh. Okay, well, we know that they're close friends. They have done, uh, you know, they, they've collaborated before where one was the producer and one was the director of, uh, I think, three individual films, maybe four. Uh, so in terms of just uh, the, the dialogue that happens between two people making a movie, there's going to be a level of shorthand that happens between them. And Soderbergh himself is really, really fast, I think, as a second unit person and just to kind of orient people as to what a second unit director is. Second unit is usually the guys that come in, they shoot the stunts, they shoot uh, not the principal actors, well, the, the main director and the principal actors are doing something else. But Soderbergh is also his own director of photography. So he's always going to be really, really fast because he knows about camera angles, where to place the camera, how to light a scene, how many setups he needs when he's making the film. So he's actually, in two days, I was laughing because in his own way, I mean, he's just like, he's like a quick draw. Like in the Old West, he's really, really fast. So I think that, that even for two days, it should be really interesting. I'm just dying to know what scenes he's going to be shooting. And that, that's been like, the, I was back through the book today trying to go figure out what section it might have been. So I'm, I'm really excited with the fact that yeah, he's coming in to be second year the guy. It was um, con on Facebook, on the extras page, and um, the extras um, said that he was doing District 11. That cool. he was there for the oh. District 11. Wow. Team, team they just, uh, so there was, an, I, there was a couple of them saying that how it was amazing to work under him and um, how, well he, how well he treated everybody and – so that I mean, in District 11 was two days of shooting. So that I assume he was there both days. Yeah. Okay. And, and so we can officially move this up from rumor to fact. I just I yeah. just, I hear a lot of things that are even on on credible sites that are negated later, and this was just so shocking to me that I was hesitant to really believe in it. But you you guys have convinced me. I'm sold that this this must have happened. <laughs> anyway, go on. <laughs> someone, someone was talking. Well, let me let me just say that who here has seen a lot of Steven Soderbergh films? I mean, Traffic comes to mind. I've seen a good amount. Most, yeah, Ocean's what you, Eleven you is the most popular fan? one, right? Yeah, Ocean's Eleven. Uh, he did uh, Tiriana. He was the producer of Tiriana. Uh, he worked on uh, Good Night and Good Luck. Uh, he does a lot of work with George Clooney. So uh, my recommendation is go out to his page in IMDb. It gives you the extraordinary uh, credits that uh, Steven Soderbergh has uh, and the work that, that he's done. It, and it's uh, it's it's very, very interesting because it's also a lot of his work is very, is very political. In some ways, he's very, very suited to work on, on the Hunger Games trilogy uh, only because of the sensibilities of the book and the sensibilities of the body of work outside of some of the comedies that he's done. Oh, my God. 